Hey guys, this is Mindy Beck with another cup of love, cup of wisdom. Let's get in here and do an energy check and see what's going on. <clears throat> I went ahead and pulled some cards, and I'm really excited about this because I feel like this is a really good read. I feel like it may be very um, relieving to some divine femmes and masculines who have been waiting for justice for a really long time. I was originally just pulling cards off camera in between playing Dr. Mario with the kiddos, you know, <clears throat> waiting for my turn. But, um, yeah, I decided that these cards were worth a really good read. So let's get in here. Um, remember, this could be past, present, or future energy. Remember, just take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Flip the signs and rolls as needed. Keep in mind, this is a collective read. Not every read is for every person. If you would like a personal read, the details are in the description box for my channel. So I have determination in the reverse. Grow in the reverse. Hunt in the reverse. And consume in the reverse. And what really got me excited is reveal in the upright. Death in the upright. And heal came out sideways. So I'm really excited about this for, for quite a few reasons. Um, it is going to be revealed... It is coming out that somebody was obsessed and consumed themselves with hunting down a person and they were determined to stop them from growing. They were stopping, um, they were trying to stop their determination, their confidence, stop them from growing um, in their career, um, for having a new start, a new beginning. Someone was trying to stop someone from getting their ace of pentacles. Um, it's like somebody stalked somebody and purposefully made their life a living hell with that hunt in the reverse, and they were consumed by this. It's like they wanted to consume everything about a person. It's like they wanted to destroy everything and devour it because they were just so greedy. It's like a bottomless pit. It's just somebody who is just, it's just giving me the spirit of disgust. This energy is just so disgusting, but... <clears throat> What really made me excited is the reveal, the death, and the heal. Because this is coming out, it's being revealed, and it's putting an end to something. Um, I feel like this person is telling on themselves by being, um, of course, narcissistic, and possibly taking some sort of action impulsively against a divine femme or masculine. This could even be like with a lawyer I'm getting or something like that. Um, or trying to get the law involved in something and it's making them look ridiculous and they are going to bring their own end to this and this is going to be healing. This is going to allow you to heal. Them revealing their own bullshit is going to put an end to something and allow you to heal. Finally, heal. Not just say you're healed, but actually heal and be left the fuck alone. Can I get an amen? This is a beautiful read, so I want to get in here and see what's going on. I was going to wait and do a read later, um, but I couldn't put these cards up. Um, I, I decided that we need to find out who's getting justice and what's going on in this situation because so many of us, um, and I'm including myself in this one, um, I'm claiming this one for sure. Um, we all deserve some justice. Hell yeah! Fuck yeah, the very first card. Hells to the yeah. Can I get an amen? Yeah. <clears throat> That's a yes card. That's a victory. You are finally going to be able to heal. You're finally getting your victory. Shit, yeah. Someone was obsessed with stopping your financial stability, affecting your financial stability. Someone was dead set obsessed, consumed with stopping you from growing and stopping you from trying to make your money. Yeah, that's the shit I'm talking about right there. That's why I love playing with my cards. I like the truth coming out. I like to know when these, mm, mm -hmm. it's about fucking time. It's about time for all of us, for everybody. Someone caused you to lose a significant amount of money, a ten of pentacles. Somebody affected your money. You lost a shit ton of money because of this asshole. Whether they're a man or a woman, they're not moving on to calmer waters. Um, they're exposing themselves and they are, oh man, it's over. Party's over. They're bringing their own death to this. This is going to be a final ending. This is like ten of swords shit right here. And you're finally going to be able to heal from the pain that this person has put you through. Especially if they've used your children against you. 
man. The slander, the lies. <clears throat> I feel like this person could be spending time behind bars. You're going to get this money back. I feel like you're getting this back. I told you, Ten of Swords, it's done. I'm telling you, I'm feeling it. Woo! I feel like I'm on a hot streak. And I don't play craps, but I feel like I'm on a hot streak on a craps table. Ooh, this is good energy. This is victory. This is victory. I'm excited about this one. Seven of Cups. Seven of Cups. Your treasure. You are the treasure. You are a treasure. And you're going to be able to heal. The fact that you've survived and healed and persevered through this... Your strength and courage. Oh my gosh. Even though someone is obsessed. <clears throat> someone's obsession is out of control. With the devil card. Someone is addicted and obsessed to making your life hell. I'm not just saying that lightly. Someone hunts you down. Stalks the shit out of you. Just to ruin every part of your life. This is an obsession. This is an addiction. This person needs psychiatric help. There is no question about it. This person is so mentally unstable. You are going to get justice. And there's a king of pentacles. You are either going to be the king of pentacles. Or this king of pentacles is going to help make it happen. This is a businessman. Someone who manages his money well financially. You could be this masculine. You could be the king of pentacles. Or this king of pentacles. I feel like this king of pentacles is going to help bring you justice. And it's on its way because this person has been admiring you um, with the Page of Cups. They've been admiring your strength and they know someone has tried to stop you from coming, from getting money. And this shit just has to be closed out. It just has to with the world card. The cycle has to end. This person has kept you going through this year after year after year on this roller coaster of hell. You have a positive outcome. You have a positive outcome. Somebody in law enforcement or good law officials are going to step in and help you with this. It's about bloody hell time. And I'm not British, but goddamn, man. Y'all have waited so long for this. I'm, I'm so excited. The energy is just off the charts. I'm, I'm not church. I feel like I'm at church. <laughs> it's off the charts. <clears throat> the energy is just off the charts right now. It's it's unbelievable. It's the, it's like electric. I'm feeling celebration, happiness. I'm seeing tears. I'm seeing people crying. Oh my god! I'm seeing you hugging somebody. Oh my god. <sighs> yeah, someone was miserable, bored. They had nothing better to do. This Joker. This person got pissed off because you got an attitude with them and you wouldn't just let them devour you and take everything from you. This person was pissed off because you wouldn't just lay down and go to sleep and let them destroy everything in your life. Because you got an attitude and stood up for yourself. This person just wouldn't stop, wouldn't stop. They were obsessed with this. This person is a bottomless pit. Someone's about to get an attitude with this mofo. That's for sure. Someone's about to set this person. Um, they're about to get put in their place. And I feel like this is going to be um, legally as well. Um, yeah. Someone's about to get smacked down off their pedestal. This, this shit's over. The entire justice system is like... I mean, there's just so many people out in the community. There's somebody... When I was reading before I started pulling these black cards, there was someone in great despair over this this what's going on here and so when i put the cards away and i reshuffled and then those cards came out i'm like all right we're getting in here we need to find out what's going on i'm gonna jump to my pink floyds Yeah, there was some sort of communication that this karmic did. This greedy, gold-digging vulture. Um, this communication that they made, <clears throat> it 
And this could be a lawyer to a law official. This is somebody who holds an office. That that much I, I do know. Um, they, uh, they revealed themselves. Their mask fell off. They revealed their true self. It's like their mask fell off in their narcissistic ways. It's like someone caught a glimpse of the real person. They're like, oh, that's the motherfucker. Oh, really? I've been representing this person all these years? Really? So this girl was telling the truth the whole time. This man was telling the truth the whole time. <clears throat> we have a feminine, a mother. This is I'm looking at this as a mother figure right now. We have a mother figure and possibly a bisexual masculine that involved a third party. And this masculine ghosted this mother figure for a third party and made their life a living hell ever since. Or this female ghosted this masculine because they knew that they had a third party. Take it how it resonates. And they made their life a living hell ever since because they refused to sit there and be abused by a narcissist. This person is not divine. They pretend to be a preacher, teacher, a spiritual leader, and they're not. You've gone through the change. You've gone through an ascension. You've gone through a transformation. You have a group of people that want to work with you. People want to band together on your behalf. They're taking a moment to pause and reflect about why somebody got ghosted, why you ghosted this masculine, or why they got ghosted whether this is man or woman, why someone had a whole group of people working against you. Yeah, and this is a good read. This is a good one. Uh, I'll pat myself on the back. I like this one. I like this one a lot. I like the truth being exposed, <clears throat> especially when people get the justice. I told you I'm a sucker for a happy ending. I, I It's about time. Y'all deserve some justice. Somebody was trying to keep secrets hidden. Someone was trying to keep a lot of secrets hidden. Who they are. They, they It's like that fox lady energy. Someone who is hiding their true intentions or personality. Um, but it's also like that tower with the crack in. Someone was hiding their true inner personality. Their true inner being. And their mask fell off in front of somebody. And this may have been the first time that this person saw it. But they saw this emperor in reverse for who they were. Now they know why you're in isolation. Why you don't deal with anybody. Why you've cut everybody off. Because they had a conversation and this narc told on themselves and revealed everything this person needed to know as to why you don't deal with people. Why you're in hermit mode. This lawyer or law official got an earful and they're like, you've got to be kidding me. This entire time, we've done this to an innocent person who didn't deserve this shit. You had me fighting someone and destroying a person for what reason? What reason do you have now? The person couldn't give them a good reason. Everything that they said was just one lie trying to cover up another lie. And this person, this official, actually got pissed off at this person. And I feel like someone was told to leave their goddamn office. Um, so if this was somebody that had been working with a lawyer or somebody for years... Um, Somebody told them to get the fuck out of the office. They're like, are you kidding me? It's like, I feel like this person met up with this lawyer. I'm, I'm strongly getting a lawyer, so I'm just going with it. Um, there was an altercation, like, in the lawyer's office. And they were, the lawyer was questioning this person. The lawyers aren't stupid. They fucking know shit, and they have a way of getting information out. And this person let some something slip. And this this lawyer was like, get the fuck out. Get out of here. Like, just get out. And don't come back. And I swear I'm seeing that lawyer hang his head down and fucking start sobbing after they told this person to leave the office because they couldn't believe what they did to an innocent person. That's the shit I'm seeing. This person is tore the fuck up right now. This lawyer energy is tore up so, so bad right now. So, so bad. After finding out the truth about what has happened all this time. Years, years this person has been abusing an innocent person and using the justice, justice system and law enforcement officials to do it and to re-traumatize them over and over. And this lawyer feel well, they did play a part in it, but, you know, they were a paid civil servant, so 
it is what it is, but somebody was innocent the entire time, and this person betrayed them and was disloyal to them, and they are the witchy any energy, this karmic energy, and they wanted this innocent person to be out in the wilderness to never come out of the wilderness. Honey, you're coming out of this wilderness. You are coming out. Man or woman, you are coming up out of this bitch. Hey, guys, can you keep it down for just a minute, please? Okay. Thank you. You are coming up out of this shit. This, someone's nervous. Someone's sweating. They know something's about to happen. They know the shit's about to hit the fan. They know it. They see it. They're sweating bullets. They are scared. This cold-hearted asshole or bitch is sweating bullets right now. Or both. There could have been more than one person that did this, um, that worked with this person. I've been picking up on an ex and a mother figure working together. Um, before I turned... Um, these cards over the reading I did that I feel like goes along with this off camera. Um, the, there was a, a feminine energy, a high priestess in the reverse. And that had someone in despair to find out that this person lied and communicated to the courts, um, a lie about somebody that was innocent. And this is just following along with that. So I won't be surprised if there is another energy that comes out, a, a mother figure that comes out. Yep. The Knight of Swords. Somebody rushed in with lies. I can't make this shit up. Someone was trying to bind a Queen of Cups. Somebody who does things from a heart space of love. Someone was trying to keep you bound in a negative situation. Keep you trapped. Isolated. They didn't want you to get any rest. This girl is on fire. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> You're about to have options. You're about to have a lot of options. It's being brought to light. The spell work, the illusions that were created by this magician. Everything was based on lies. Every false accusation, every report that was made against you, every time the police were called, all of it was lies, lies, lies. And they were trying, they got creative with this shit, but it was like trying to teach a dog a new trick. They didn't learn new tricks. They just kept doing the same shit over and over again. And that's another reason people started questioning what the hell's going on here. Because you are being seen as the official person. You are the authentic, the real spiritual teacher, the real deal, honey, man or woman. This was a karmic relationship. You learned your lesson, but this person didn't learn theirs. And they were trying to make you pay repeatedly for their stupidity. Fuck. I nah. I don't fucking think so. This karmic that you learned your lesson from was trying to make you pay because they can't learn theirs. I don't think so. Time's up. Spirit said time is fucking up. It's done. The cycle is over. Finite. Finished. Whew, this is a good one. I, I'm happy for this read. I've been doing so many lately where it's all doom and gloom and negativity and bad shit. And man, it's about time we take a win. It's about time we get a win. Yep, you're going to be getting some sort of communication that's going to help heal. In the upright, I look at this as healing. I don't give a shit what other readers say. In the upright, this is healing. In the reverse, I look at this as heartbreak. In the upright, this is healing from the heartbreak. You're going to be getting some communication about that. It's going to make you heal. It's, it's going to be the finality. It's over. This shit is over. It's about time. Yeah, people were trying to... This karmic was trying to keep people blinded from the truth. And the two of swords at the crossroads. They didn't want people to see the truth about the situation. They didn't want their mask to fall off. They didn't want people to see them for who they truly are. So they tried to destroy an innocent person. <clears throat> this jealous king of cups 
an ex-lover, somebody who did things based on emotions. This person needs to heal their childhood wounds. They need to learn their lessons. They're emotionally unstable and unbalanced, and they're a narcissist and extremely codependent. They tried to stop you from getting every offer that came your way. Someone's taking a moment to pause and reflect about this. Like, hmm, something's not right in this situation. Why does this person want someone out in the cold so bad? Why did this person leave this person out in the cold so bad? Um, now I'm seeing why they left this person. Because they are an abuser. Emotionally, verbally, possibly physically. This was an absolute tyrant. They took something very important from you. They took a gift from you. This could be your child. This could be anything that you hold important to you. That's being laid to rest. You are in your boss energy. Even if you're a female, you're in your masculine energy. You are coming up the leader. Even in the last reading I did, it kept coming up King of Wands, King of Wands, King of Wands. So even if you're a female, you're in your masculine boss energy. I mean, you are, you're on your shit. You are a true fucking leader. You are the boss. Somebody was just trying to make a shitty, slippery offer to slip right out of something. That's being laid to rest, too. They made you a... Yeah. Someone's not going to take this person's money anymore. I'm telling you, I'm here and get the fuck out of my office. Get the fuck out now. And I feel like I've heard that before in a reading, too. I'm here and get the fuck out. The swift action is going to be taken. You're going to hear something soon. Yeah, someone spied. Some, there was a thief. Someone stole something from a Queen of Cups. Something very valuable. Something important. Time, money, energy, your sanity, your children, your home, your car, your life, your career, everything. This person wanted to steal from you. Fuck you, karmic. Fuck you, karmic. Let's get some message cards before I run out of time here. Somebody says, it was a misunderstanding. No, no, you misunderstood me. That's not what I meant. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Someone perjured themselves on the stand. And this lawyer is asking them, you said under oath. I'm hearing, you said under oath. And this person's like, what? No, it's a misunderstanding. No, motherfucker, you perjured yourself. You can cost me to get to his bard. What the fuck? I can't represent you anymore. I'm hearing, oh, man. Someone needs to focus on themselves. Or someone was so focused on themselves. Someone was selfish. Someone is so focused on themselves. They're saying something was a misunderstanding. This is the narcissist that's saying this. So, yeah. Hells, yeah. There's going to be a law upholding judge that's about to do a return to sender. Fuck, yeah. How's about a return to sender in the justice system? How many of y'all have seen that? I haven't. It's about fucking time, though, isn't it? This ain't just about a return to sender in the spiritual realm. That's a return to sender. Karma being balanced out in the 3D, in the justice system, by law upholding judges. Can I get an amen? Amen. A return, a return to sender by a law upholding judge. It doesn't get any better than that shit. This person's a carrier of something. Smiles are contagious. Be a carrier. They're infected with something. Um, and then it literally just flipped over with an incurable STD. So I'm going to leave it on that side. So they're, they're a carrier. Not just a carrier, but they have an incurable STD that they contracted. Wow. There is no promotion coming from them. They tried to stop you from getting every promotion. Every job you had, they wanted you fired. This person lost their job probably as well. They're not getting a promotion. Mm -mm. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. This motherfucker's going to jail. Someone committed crimes. They did something in the last one to two weeks. Something happened in the last one to two weeks. Or one to two weeks is significant. They're going to. <clears throat> they did something in the last one to two weeks to an authentic teacher or a prophet. The real deal. They did something that they can't undo to a real motherfucker. Man or woman. Please believe that. 
please believe that. You are the real one, honey. That's why I'm so excited about this reading. Y'all deserve a little love and victory. Someone's looking at your photo and they can't believe what they're seeing. They can't believe it. The changes that you've gone through. How do you still have... That's going to make me fucking cry. How are you still smiling after all you've been through? This lawyer is tore the fuck up. How are you still smiling after what this person did to you? Jesus. It's because you use your intuition and you knew someday you were going to get justice. Someone's going to tell you some important information. Man, this shit's tearing me up. Someone's waited a long time for this. This person will not miraculously recover. They think they're going to heal from whatever shit they're infected with and they're not going to. And that's their karma for what they've done to someone who was innocent. How are you still smiling after everything you've been through? That's the... That got me right in my heart, man. That got me, I'm fucking crying, man. Whew. Covering up illegal activities. Gold digger. Intentionally causing injustice. Yeah, they're sweating. They're anxious. They acted like a fucking child. I thought this was high school. There's going to be a raid drug buster SWAT team. God damn. Wah. Hoorah. Ah. This karmic was as dull as dishwater. They wanted you to be begging on the fucking street. You're coming out of a dark and stormy night. This person's going to be biting the bullet. They were willing to do anything. There was no equal give and take. They were willing to do everything to take everything from you. Everything. Being a pain in the neck, a pain in the butt. That is That doesn't even come close to describing what this person did to you. This doesn't even come fucking close. None of these cars have words on there that comes close to what this person did to you. They slandered you. They've aired your dirty laundry. They made shit up. Guess whose dirty laundry is being exposed now, bitch? Hide that. You told on yourself. Give enough rope and they'll all hang themselves. Something could be happening at the crack of dawn. They were greedy. They just wanted money to burn. They didn't. They they didn't have a clue. They they didn't. They don't have a clue. There is no money for them to get. They will never touch one penny of your money. Whatever they thought they were going to get, it ain't happening. It is not happening. There's something significant about a Capricorn. In Monday, January. You are seen as stuff dreams are made out of, and someone just got caught in the crossfire. You, and if you have kids, your kids too, man. A lot of innocent people got hurt because of what this person did. A family, multiple families got destroyed because of this. People turned their back. They wouldn't help an innocent person because they sided with someone just because they thought they were an upstanding person. Meanwhile, sometime in the fall, this asshole who's as slippery as an eel... Did something this past summer. They've been doing something since this past summer. Um, they told on themselves for something that they did in the summertime. You've had to make the best out of a bad situation. And now they're backed up against the wall. They wanted you backed up against the wall. Mm -mm. This fucker ain't coming out of the woods. Because they are ugly as sin. Something significant could be Sunday. This person loved and lost you. They're going into their worst nightmare. Like father, like son. This is... This is, um, you know, the father of your child. If you have children, you're younger than this person, and they are envious of you. They were envious of you, jealous of you. They wanted their moment of glory, moment of truth. Well, you're going to get it on a mugshot, baby. All right, let's pull some letters here. Whew, person, place, or thing. Oh, I had one fall on my lap. I had M. Can I get an Amen? <laughs> I told you I'm claiming this reading. I'm claiming it all fucking day long. Every. Mm hmm. Z. Yep. W. A. Y. 
you're about to get your way. F. Family. You're about to get your family back. G. I. A. S. And I'll do two more. C. And O. C O. Corrections Officer. M Z. W A S F A I Y G. I hope this helps, folks. Have a good night.